The IERS Reference Meridian IRM, also called the International Reference Meridian, is the prime meridian zero degrees longitude maintained by the International Earth Rotation and Reference Systems Service IERS. It passes about 5.3 arcseconds east of George Biddle Aries 1851 transit circle or 102 meters 335 feet at the latitude of the Royal Observatory, Greenwich. It is also the reference meridian of the Global Positioning System GPS operated by the United States Department of Defense, and of WGS-84 and its two formal versions, the Ideal International Terrestrial Reference System and its realization, the International Terrestrial Reference Frame ITRF. Location The reason for the 5.3 arcsecond offset between the IERS reference meridian and the Airy transit circle is that the observations with the transit circle were based on the local vertical, while the IERS reference is a geodetic longitude, that is, the plane of the meridian contains the center of mass of the Earth. The International Hydrographic Organization adopted an early version of the IRM in 1983 for all nautical charts. The IRM was adopted for air navigation by the International Civil Aviation Organization on 3 March 1989. Tectonic plates slowly move over the surface of Earth, so most countries have adopted for their maps an IRM version fixed relative to their own tectonic plate as it existed at the beginning of a specific year. Examples include the North American Datum 1983 83 Namibian dollars, the European Terrestrial Reference Frame 1989 ETRF 89, and the Geocentric Datum of Australia 1994 GDA 94. Versions fixed to a tectonic plate differ from the global version by at most a few centimetres. However, the IRM is not fixed to any point on Earth. Instead, all points on the European portion of the Eurasian plate, including the Royal Observatory, are slowly moving northeast about 2.5 cm per year relative to it. Thus this IRM is the weighted average in the least squares sense of the reference meridians of the hundreds of ground stations contributing to the IERS network. The network includes GPS stations, satellite laser ranging SLR stations, lunar laser ranging LLR stations, and the highly accurate Very Long Baseline Interferometry VLBI stations. All stations' coordinates are adjusted annually to remove net rotation relative to the major tectonic plates. If Earth had only two hemispherical plates moving relative to each other around any axis which intersects their centers or their junction, then the longitudes around any other rotation axis of any two, diametrically opposite, stations must move in opposite directions by the same amount. The 180th meridian is opposite the IERS reference meridian and forms a great circle with it dividing the Earth into Western Hemisphere and Eastern Hemisphere. Universal time is notionally based on the WGS84 meridian. Because of changes in the rate of Earth's rotation, standard international time UTC can differ from the mean observed solar time at noon on the prime meridian by up to 0.9 second. Leap seconds are inserted periodically to keep UTC close to Earth's angular position relative to the Sun, see mean solar time. <laughs> List of places Starting at the North Pole and heading south to the South Pole, the IERS reference meridian passes through eight countries. See also First meridian east First meridian west 180th meridian Prime meridian Greenwich. Prime meridian Coordinated universal time